Holy cow! Hi guys, uh, Daryl here, and this is Aubrey from Sailing Miss Lone Star. Uh, we just named this channel. This is going to be my second video, and uh, we named it "I Dream of Dingy." We'll <laughs> see how that goes in the comments later. But That's so good. <laughs> um, I'm just down here in LA in Oxnard, right? Mm -hmm. We're gonna go out. I have never been to the Channel Islands, so Aubrey's gonna take us out. We're gonna go sail around Santa Barbara. Is it? Mm, Santa Santa Cruz. Uh, Santa oh, one we of the should know this. The second <laughs> island, then the little island. San Marcos. Oh gosh. Where are we? It's a San something. <laughs> we don't know where we it's are. There. We'll figure it out later. <laughs> so, so, so we're gonna head out. What tomorrow morning? Yes. In the early in the morning. Yes. My goal is to see if I can actually get in the water. This last year, I have swam with the shark once, and I wanted to get rid of my fear of swimming with sharks. So let's see if I can make it this time. It's it's literally the great white breeding ground. Without me pushing you? So we'll see what happens. <laughs> I might, I might not. <laughs> All right, you guys, so will he make it? Will he not make it? We don't know. Let's do this. <laughs> This is it. We woke up early, went to Starbucks, and now we're on the maiden voyage. Captain Aubrey is kicking butt. Gone off the dock without an issue. Let's go see how things are going. How's it going, Cap? I'm feeling good. I'm pretty excited. All right, how was the first one? It was so easy. To be fair, there's no wind, and I had like a training wheels of a bow thruster race out here. We didn't use it. We didn't use it, no. but we had them available, which is nice. We're confidence building. <laughs> destination we have a waypoint I haven't actually looked at how far away it is yet 10 miles out probably down and we had just enough time to get out in the dinghy and check the place out so we ended up going in these really cool caves and we ended up walking around on the beach we did get the dinghy stuck and ended up being completely soaking wet by the time we had got it back in the water but we did complete the task what a blast we had this is episode one of dirty dinghy feet Going live! Oh. <laughs> yeah, you gotta like the, you gotta go like this. Like we gotta be relaxing. Oh. Dirty, no, 
muddy, not dirty. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> That's it. That's it. <laughs> okay, it is 9, 9.30 at night. I've been chumming the water with some fresh mackerel and squid blood. Um, let's see what we can get. I have a jar of gut and a whole fridge more. Let's see what we can catch. Wait for it. Okay, there has been something swimming by, but it's like hard to know what it was. The bait bin is still down in the water. I did see something happening. There is something here. I know it. I just saw it swim by. I don't know what that was, but I saw it come up crest and pop. Well, at this point, I'm thinking about going in. It's getting cold. I have, I don't even have shoes on, so uh, it's winter time. I absolutely love it when it's just rocking and rolling. Rockin' and roll, it's the best at anchor, I love it. Just doing a little night watch. We haven't budged an inch. We're on a little scorpion and it looks like we're holding nicely. I'm back, heading off to bed. I just woke up, it's about six in the morning. I was just doing another weather check. We haven't moved at all. We did put a lot of chain out. That doesn't surprise me. I wanna get out in the dinghy and I wanna explore. That's what we're gonna do today. Arbor is not awake yet, but I just came out to watch the sunset and find out that the sun's not coming up. It's clouds. I'll hang out for a bit and uh, enjoy this beautiful flat morning. Okay, so we're gonna let the dinghy down. We lifted it last night, which worked out super well. That was Daryl's idea, good yab. Good yab, my friend. So we're gonna lower it and we're gonna go check out these islands. What do you think? Is it gonna be epic? Oh yeah, we're looking for caves now. We oh, didn't catch any We were sharks. looking for sharks and now we're looking for caves. Yeah. Maybe cave sharks. Well, can't <laughs> catch a shark. It's gonna be great. All right, so I built this bridle. It's not perfect. I think I could have used heavier line and uh, tied it so it was a little more even, but you live and you learn. My first one. All right, sweet. We are in the water. Good job, high five. Yep, teamwork makes the dream work. Oh, dude, is that okay? <laughs> what do you think? I'm gonna use your shoulder here. This operation is what I like to call driving Miss Daisy. Can we tuck in there and get out of the rain for a spell? Yeah, I'm thinking. <laughs> Look at this guy. Cruise us up to him. I think he's gonna jump in the boat. Look at him. He's like. <laughs> Look at his face! What? Oh my god! Yeah, I'm like, cruise us up oh. to him! I just saw us getting dragged out. I was like, this is in the hole. No, look at, look at that! Yeah, no, it's insane. Look at him, he's just chilling. Okay, Casey jumps in my lap. I think it's a girl. Yeah, I'm hanging on good. This is pretty wild. Pretty cool. So wild. Don't you feel like an adventurer when you're out here? Yeah. Kind of weather? No one around. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And on the rock. Oh my goodness. Keep your mouth closed when you look up. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. 
Good to go. Wow, that is so beautiful. to head home. I'm having a little bit of uh, bad luck shark fishing. So I do have <laughs> a whole container with no bites on it that now I have to clean up. Let's clean up the mackerel and the squid and head all the way back. Okay, where are we heading, Cap? We are headed back to Oxnard. Yeah, we're gonna put her back in the slip and uh, see how we did. Nice, the wind's supposed to pick up this afternoon. It sure is. We've got 13 knots right now, so I think maybe when we get through these islands right here, we pull the headsail out. Okay, nice. Give it a try. Right on, I'm in. That, that, that. All the sails on the boat, precision sails made. I'm really happy. This is awesome. What a blast to get out here with Aubrey. We've had such a fun time on Santa Cruz Island. Uh, we explored a ton of caves. We saw some wildlife, uh, went to shore. Yeah, really, really awesome. Great time. So good. Okay, one more successful docking operation under my belt with lots of help from people who know how to do it way better than me. <laughs> that is not true. That is not true. <laughs> I'm leaving the boat today and I can't wait to tell you what happened out there. Anyways, right now I'm just doing some packing. Everything is coming along. I have been at it for hours basically um, and I'm good to go. So just a couple last things to put in the bag and uh, I'll fill you in on how things went. Okay. I just finished packing. I am ready to go. I've loaded my gear up and out. It's ready to get into the car and head to the airport. Aubrey's not around right now, but I'll keep you guys posted on how the trip went in a little while. I had some high expectations coming into the trip and you know I didn't quite get everything done I wanted to. But anyways, right now we're just getting in the car and heading off. I'll keep you posted later. We did have a lot of fun. It was just a great trip overall. But I wanna go over some of the things that I didn't end up doing and what happened. 